Books. Yeah, it's well, time of for the uh, Indie Now <laughs> Book Club with our friends from the Indie Public Library. This is Amira Malcolm, and she's here. Hello, Hello. how are you? Good to see you. Good hey, to Amira. see you. Hi. So good to have it's you here. Good to see you. We'll yeah. save you a hoagie. Oh, okay. yeah. please do. I'm actually from Philly, so I'm looking forward to that. What? Nice. Okay, then you're going to appreciate that bread. Of course, of yes. course. <laughs> Walk well, us through some of the titles that you brought today. Yeah, of course. Well, we are so excited to have the fifth anniversary of the Center for Black Literature and Culture coming up on the 29th. And so I just wanted to bring you through um, some of these books just to kind of take you through the journey of the CBLC. Okay. So the CBLC, it was started in 2017 and it aims to be a place where people can get context and access to a lot of different areas of African American culture. And this is a space for everybody. Okay. So kind of just starting from a place of knowledge, we can start with, so you want to talk about race and stand from the beginning just to get a little bit of background on some of the current context that we have going on in the city okay. and the country and just get a little bit more information about those things. Yeah, so walk us through each one of these books. Yeah, of course. Just kind of going, just kind of moving through. I think one of the one of the best and the worst things about the CBLC is that people are often surprised by the vast collection that we have. Okay. So it's great that people are getting to know this this resource in the city and being able to get connected with books, but we definitely want this to be able to be an opportunity for everybody to get involved with the library. So in thinking about the aspect of community that we've really found in this space, I really wanted to talk about the, the importance of dents in the ceiling and then also talking about um, Maya Angelou's book. But before that, I do want to get to You Are Your Best Thing by Tarana Burke and Brene Brown. This, okay. is, this is something that I have personally in my own collection. Yeah. And it's just um, a beginning of essays about um, how community is kind of built through connections. And that's something that the CBLC is very about as we kind of just continue to work with our programs, continue to be able to kind of just share our story and get those things as well and just kind of looking toward the future, just kind of things that people can look forward to. We're also having um, some indie authors come to the CBLC on the, on the 29th to be able to talk about their books. And so one of those local authors is Angel Henry. So okay. she, she wrote um, Dents in the Ceiling, which is about tools women and allies need to break through. So some so more tools for readers as well. Okay. And then just kind of going toward the future, we're talking about making all making sure that all black lives matter. Okay. And then even getting into the Christmas season, we have singing and swinging and getting merry like Christmas with Maya Angelou. Okay. And so this is a continuation of her autobiography, but just bringing in um, a lot of different topics that people may not think that they find in the CBLC. Um, this area really just brings context to a lot of those different areas. So on the 29th from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m., we're going to be in the CBLC having music, a lot of different connections happening. So it's going to be a great time. That's fun. Yeah. I know, like you said, a lot of people are surprised by just the vast collection and the resources. And what we often see when you guys come on is there are so many free things that people can yes. access through the library. Absolutely. There are so many different databases that you have access to, online books. We have a ton of digital ebooks available through the Lily and Over through the Libby and Overdrive apps. There's a lot of different access. Um, our collection is over 20,000 strong with, with um, items for children, adults, teens, just a vast amount of information. That's great. Amir, if you had to pick one of these books oh, gosh. for someone to read, that's I'm putting hard. you on the yeah. spot. It's a good question, though. Which one would you go well, with? We start oh, with? man. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's hard. I do want to say you are your best thing because I really okay. do appreciate um, it's an anthology, so there's a lot of different perspectives in that book, and it really just kind of, kind of talks about the community and a lot of things that can kind of come from bringing people together and just making those connections. That's and great. That's yeah. something that's so important. Awesome. All right, really remind people about the event yes. just one more time on Absolutely. the 29th. Absolutely. The CBLC 5th anniversary is on October 29th. It's going to be from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. We're partnering with Indiana Librarians Leading in Diversity, and we're going to have a featured speaker, Dr. Nicole A. Cook, who teaches at the University of South Carolina. So there's going to be a featured speaker. We're going to have music. We're going to have authors. We're going to have performances. It's going to be a great time, and I hope everybody comes down. Love it. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much for sharing these books with us and telling us about these upcoming events. We Absolutely. appreciate it so yeah. much. We have Indie Public Library's website right there if you want to learn all that information.